Everybody says most you're back with another video games with an NBA 2K20 Chicago was my like episode number 38. And before we get anywhere, uh, I'm just gonna apologize for the cut the quality of this video. I have no idea why it's pixelated and the quality is not like even 720. I just want to say it straight up, so i uh, just say no. I don't know what happened. I you know I did my normal like how to recording and then I, I didn't notice it until I started editing and I'm like wait a minute I can barely see some of these guys at some at, you know points. I mean obviously it's fine. Uh, you can still you know you know see what's going on, but it's just not that usual 1080 60 you know content you guys are used to. So I do apologize for that. And this was a fun game to play too. And actually I found out it actually happened again and it was Rockets episode 40, the final episode. And. Uh, it wasn't as bad, at least at some points. It was, you know, even worse at some spots. But as we see, uh, Drew Holiday now going to get a little open, but instead he's going to feed it inside of that mean tomahawk from Aaron Gordon. He's got five points now, and so does Zach Levine have five. And Levine goes right to the rack, throws it on down. So I just want to apologize, get that out of the way for right now. And then uh, let's get straight into the gameplay. So Drew Holiday now going to go inside and score. Here's D'Angelo. <laughs> he's full of the defense, but he's going to fire it outside of Zach. That's green. We're looking right away. Fort Levine did knock that shot down. Now Levine stepping it back right at the Bulls logo. Misses, but then a tip up and in by WCJ. Here's Holiday for the three. Rattles that one on down in 25-13 now. And Rose entering the ball game and going up in one in the second quarter. To the hometown hero, Derrick Rose, back in Chicago. See what he can do. Rose, crossover, getting the screen. Now he's going to attack. And what a beautiful move getting two defenders in the air. And then scores, of course, being, you know, two feet from the basket. Here's Cam Reddish blowing past the defense in a nice reverse slam. Now Rose over to White. White, Kobe inside, goes up. A beautiful, another, another beautiful movement. We're putting on a little bit of a show down low with some of these moves we're putting on. And now Rose, elbow jumper. That's green. Rose is pretty much automatic in that mid-range area. And uh, Rose, look at this. You sag off your swag, so baby. You know the rules, Rose. Green, there you, Rose. Making it rain from downtown the night. Nasty crossover. Killer crossover. Going inside. Misses. But Gaffer puts it up and in with the putback. Now here's Rose. Another quick crossover. He's going to find that Bulls logo. His spot to knock it down. He's got 14 points now. And Rose up top to Gaffer with the lefty punch um, down into the bottom of the net. As we take a look at that replay. Nice play there. Here is Rose going to blow past Kyrie inside scores. Could have passed him, but we're looking to score and attack Rose. Now he's putting on some uh, nifty jewel moves, and now he's going to fade away from that Bulls logo in with the shot. Come on, jeez. 53-42, and there goes putting on a show in that first half. We'll see what he does in the second. As now Holiday, we love this mid-range. Um, we're a great team, you know, in, from three as well. The Chicago Bulls team that we, we have, but the mid-range we're excellent at as well. We have a lot of great mid-range players, uh, but we do like shooting that three too. So, oh my goodness, D'Angelo Russell putting on all the moves now, and he drains a three over Kyrie Irving. As we're up by 12, Zach Levine now being guarded by Karis Levert blows past him and one. For Zach Levine. Now here's Levine inside, splitting the fenders in a throwdown. He got 17 on the night. And now Levine isolating behind the bag. Now he's going to step it back, looking for the trade ball. Got it. Zach Levine starting to heat up here in this third quarter. And Gordon outside of Levine again. He's running away. He knows that's going down. He's taunting that Brooklyn Nets bench. And in game seven, I forgot to mention this is game seven. This is huge. So now Levine inside, and it's an easy reverse slam for him. Now Levine outlet pass to Drew Holiday. Holiday looking to go inside. Gets bumped a few times, then scores with the layup. And now we're up by 16. Make it 19 as uh, Levine drains the three. That's a green. Now here's a rose. He's got 22. We'll see how many he can add in this. Uh, fourth quarter with six minutes left as he gets that to go. 24 points down for him, also four assists. And now Derrick Rose, uh, maybe looking for that mid range, and he found his spot again. We're just getting, we're getting our spots, and Rose is knocking him down. So uh, that's exactly what we want to do. And Rose fading away, using that to his advantage. That's a green light. And now uh, we're pulling off a lot of signature stuff here with Derrick. And uh, D Rose inside in and scores. 
um, crafty down there in that painted area and Rose he wants the three he knocks it down straight away running away after Rose got takeover shot creator pulls up green or no uh, mind, it was no green I thought it was a green <laughs> my bad uh, anyway Rose inside on the fast break scores with the layup as he's at the 38 now Rose quick cross over the they're trying to make a double team Rose is too quick jumps out into the paint and scores with the layup and now Derek looking to get past all these defenders I wish he could throw that down with the mean slam like he could in his MVP days man that would be so fun to do that but uh, he's still gonna get this you know the score and Holiday now up to 11 double figures after that bucket now D'Lo catch shoot green over Kyrie after Rose was getting double team now Derek over two defenders hits that shot he's at 47 can he get uh, his career high and he hits this shot he's insane Derek Rose uh, with Kyrie on his back goes inside doesn't get blocked 51 with the green light for D Rose I believe his career high was that 50 point game when he was on the Timberwolves so he's got a career high in the playoffs in game seven against the Brooklyn Nets Kyrie Irving Kevin Durant so that is huge Derrick Rose on his way to try to get a ring, and we'll see on who we take a little bit later on. But Rose getting really excited here. He was not on our team last year. I decided to trade for him. I sent Aransky for him in you know about mid-season. You know we got him on the squad, and we will definitely take all that he provides. As you know, just gave us a 51-point game, so we'll definitely take that. Uh, with you know <laughs> being a Chicago person, I absolutely love to see it. So I'd love to see that in real life as well. Rose return home. Uh, wow, no f Whoa, no fans at March Madness. Insane, because of the coronavirus. <laughs> I think it's not March Madness then. It's just, it's just basketball games with no fans. That's boring. That's like, that's like my high school games. <laughs> anyway, uh, Rose of 51 and 5. 20, 32, 4, 7 down. Sam Levine also 4, 7. 10 of 18 in the field. He had 30. So what a uh, nice night from him as they combined for 81. For Kobe, baby. Um, Russell with um, nine points. Wendell Carter Jr. with 19 boards. Crazy game from him on that uh, side, you know, you know, part of the basketball court. As Carmelo had five. And on the other side, Kevin Moore had 20 and 21. And Kyrie had 20 in six more minutes. But they struggled overall. We held them, uh, you know, to not a great percentage. Shooting, we take a team comparison. They shot 44%. 40 from downtown. We shot 52, 60 overall. 40 in the paint. 61 bench points, of course. Uh, 35 on the break. We had more offensive boards, defensive boards, steals. Uh, we had less turnovers. They only had five. We, we, you know, uh, that wasn't that wasn't too good. So let's take a look at the shot chart here real quick. You can see we out rebounded them by 11. Excuse me. As it's game seven on the other side, and the Rockets take down Golden State. I'm playing against my own team. That's tough. And you guys remember, I did trade Robert Covington to uh, the. You know, you know, I was gonna do D'Angelo to the Timberwolves and all that. Well, I tried to Capella to the Heat or to the excuse me, the Hawks, and so, uh, yeah. So they have Roko. They don't really have a center now, but it's a little more updated to what it is in real life. But the fact is, that seems to make them really good, um, as they just made the NBA Finals and took down Golden State. So I think there was like a fully healthy Golden State too, or something, you know, close to it. But um, Levine with 24. Uh, per game in this playoff series, you guys can see a little bit of the part of 36 as well. Holly with 18, Rose up to 14, uh, Aaron Gordon with about 12, Kobe White with only 8. So I'd like to see those numbers go up for him. And then per 36 for everybody, you just quickly take a glance at all these. Cam Reddish with 23. Um, nice to see that. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you catch up on the video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.